So this picture, I just pointed it straight up and took a somewhat longer exposure and got quite a few stars. Um, so here I'm zooming in on Saturn and it's pretty amazing. This is the first time I'm zooming in on it. Um, it looks a, a bit better than you get from the P900. And uh, this is a stabilized version. This is before I had, well, I guess I had my, my tripod at this point, but you can't even tell. I mean, when you're zoomed in that much, it just bounces all over the place. And I don't have the best tripod in the world. I pretty much, with this camera, I'm thinking I need to go with the um, the equatorial tripod, as they call it. Um, so we'll see. Because those start at 250 bucks, and I've already sunk one point something grand into this little thing project, but it is fun, and uh, it's a, a amazing images. I have so much footage, I can't, I mean, YouTube will crash if I try to publish all this 4K. I mean, everything I'm taking is fascinating, at least to me. <clears throat> but there are some things I'm going to show you uh, that are a little bit special, as they say. Things that are spatial. Um, spatial, as in space. space. No, not that kind of space. We're not talking about fake space. We're talking about something that is unique, something that will be not like other people's P1000 videos. And there are a lot of them, I'm sure, who have a steadier hand than I. I'm uh, versed in photography, but I am not by any means what I would call an expert. I know a good photograph when I see one, but uh, taking it is a different story. Now, here's stabilized. It's just This just is the full zoom in on the moon.